In mathematics, magnitude is the size of a mathematical object, a property which determines whether the object is larger or smaller than other objects of the same kind. More formally, an object's magnitude is the displayed result of an ordering or ranking of the class of objects to which it belongs. Topic: History The Greeks distinguished between several types of magnitude, including positive fractions, line segments ordered by length, plane figures ordered by area, solids ordered by volume. Angles ordered by angular magnitude they proved that the first two could not be the same, or even isomorphic systems of magnitude. They did not consider negative magnitudes to be meaningful, and magnitude is still chiefly used in contexts in which zero is either the smallest size or less than all possible sizes. <laughs> Numbers. The magnitude of any number is usually called its absolute value or modulus, denoted by x. Topic real numbers The absolute value of a real number r is defined by r equals r if r zero display style left r right equals r text if r text zero r equals minus r if r zero display style left r right equals r text if r absolute value may be thought of as the number's distance from zero on the real number line for example the absolute value of both 70 and -70 is 70 topic complex numbers A complex number Z may be viewed as the position of a point P in a two-dimensional space, called the complex plane. The absolute value or modulus of Z may be thought of as the distance of P from the origin of that space. The formula for the absolute value of Z equals a plus by is similar to that for the Euclidean norm of a vector in a two-dimensional Euclidean space Z equals Two plus b two display style left z right equals sqrt a carrot two plus b carrot two, where the real numbers are and b are the real part and the imaginary part of z, respectively. For instance, the modulus of minus three plus four i is minus three. 2 plus 4 2 equals 5 display style sqrt minus 3 caret 2 plus 4 caret 2 equals 5 alternatively the magnitude of a complex number z may be defined as the square root of the product of itself and its complex conjugate z where for any complex number z topic a plus by its complex conjugate is z a minus by z equals Z Z equals a plus B I a minus B I equals a two minus a B I plus a B I minus B two I two equals a two plus B 
two Display style left Z right equals SQRT Z Z carrot asterisk equals SQRT A plus by a by equals SQRT a carrot two Abby plus A B I B carrot two I carrot two equals SQRT a carrot two plus B carrot two Recall I two equals Minus one Display style I carrot two equals minus one. Topic Vector spaces Topic Euclidean vector space A Euclidean vector represents the position of a point P in a Euclidean space. Geometrically, it can be described as an arrow from the origin of the space vector tail to that point vector tip. Mathematically, a vector x in an n-dimensional Euclidean space can be defined as an ordered list of n real numbers the Cartesian coordinates of P, x equals x1, x2, xn. Its magnitude or length is most commonly defined as its Euclidean norm or Euclidean length. X equals x one two plus x two two plus plus x n Two Display style Math BF x equals SQRT x underscore one carrot two plus x underscore two carrot two plus CDOTS plus x underscore N carrot two for instance, in a three-dimensional space, the magnitude of three, four, twelve is thirteen because three two plus 4 2 plus 12 2 equals 169 equals 13 Display style SQRT three carrot two plus four carrot two plus one two carrot two equals SQRT one hundred and sixty nine equals thirteen. This is equivalent to the square root of the dot product of the vector by itself. X equals X X Display style Math BF x equals SQRT Math BF x CDOT Math BF x The Euclidean norm of a vector is just a special case of Euclidean distance, the distance between its tail and its tip. Two similar notations are used for the Euclidean norm of a vector x x Display style left Math BF x right X display style left math BF X right a disadvantage of the second notation is that it is also used to denote the absolute value of scalars and the determinants of matrices and therefore can be ambiguous topic normed vector spaces By definition, all Euclidean vectors have a magnitude see above. However, the notion of magnitude cannot be applied to all kinds of vectors. A function that maps objects to their magnitudes is called a norm. A vector space endowed with a norm, such as the Euclidean space, is called a normed vector space. Not all vector spaces are normed. Topic: Pseudo-Euclidean space. In a pseudo-Euclidean space, the magnitude of a vector is the value of the quadratic form for that vector. Topic: 
Topic: <laughs> Logarithmic magnitudes. When comparing magnitudes, a logarithmic scale is often used. Examples include the loudness of a sound measured in decibels, the brightness of a star, and the Richter scale of earthquake intensity. Logarithmic magnitudes can be negative. It is not meaningful to simply add or subtract them. Topic: <laughs> Order of magnitude Orders of magnitude denote differences in numeric quantities, usually measurements, by a factor of 10. That is, a difference of one digit in the location of the decimal point. See also Number sense